Well, hi everybody. Um, just that we do a quick weather walk live. Um, it's going to be windy where you are, uh, anywhere in the UK or Ireland today. Uh, really suffering with strong winds, and it's the ideal day to start um, learning about the Beaufort Scale. If you're not familiar with this, um, or you've heard of it and you kind of know what it is, but you've never really uh, taken much notice of it, then um, today really is a great day for learning it because we've got gusts of wind coming through and uh, you can check those gusts of wind against the scale. Now, um, the Beaufort scale really is one of the best ways that you can learn uh, about wind speed, about how to estimate what that speed is. And it's really easy to do. All you do is you set yourself limits. So set yourself some parameters as to what you feel comfortable with. And then um, you can adjust those parameters accordingly. So for example, I'm sort of walking at the moment, you can probably hear the wind um, that's blowing through here right now. You can see as well the trees moving around too. So they're swaying in the breeze. So this is telling me that this is actually a 4-6 breeze that we've got out here at the moment it's a fresh breeze um, it's gusting up to four seven at times and what the Beaufort scale does is it gives you certain parameters certain visual parameters that you can look around for and make a prediction as to what the wind speed actually is and it's remarkably accurate and it's something that I use every day and whether you're flying whether you're sailing whether you're farming whether you're walking whatever you're doing the Beaufort scale really is um, a useful tool to get used to. And as I say, really good on a windy day as well to start predicting it. I mean, now, this little section of my walk, the wind has decreased. It's probably down to top end of a force four or a force five. I know that because smaller branches on the trees are in sway. Uh, whereas previously, when it was a force six, it was the larger branches that were in sway. So. That tells me that wind speeds, if they're a force five, are gonna be somewhere between what, 18 and 22, 23 knots, something of that order. Um, so I know immediately that the wind is a little bit lighter. And if you set yourself your own set of parameters as well that you're comfortable with and your own set of limits, it soon becomes really easy to assess what the wind is and assess whether it puts you outside of, of your limits. Now, where do you find the Beaufort scale? Well, if you go to the Weather School website, so if you go to weatherschool.co.uk and have a look under freebies, there's a little section on top of the menu that says freebies. If you go there and um, just click on that little freebies section, scroll down to the bottom and I've put a section on there called Beaufort scale. Click on that and it gives you the scale. It gives you the visual references as well. And just have it to hand. You know, you might be sitting inside, you might be in your office, but have a peek outside. Look what's going on, look what's blown around and start making estimates as to what the wind speeds are. You can check your estimates as well. If you go to weatheronline.co.uk, click on current weather and then click on wind speeds. There, uh, you'll get a nice map of the UK. Uh, or if you're, you're um, anywhere else in the world, you can click on various different maps. You'll get a nice map of wherever you might be uh, in the world and it will tell you what the wind speeds are at the moment. So go and have a go at doing that and see if you can make a good guesstimate as to what the wind speed is where you are right now. Um, okay, it was only a quickie. So uh, great to see you all. Hi to uh, PPL uh, Returner. Hi to James the Pilot. Good to see you. Uh, hi Flying with Kia. Nice to see you too. Uh, we got THJC. Good to see you. And Plum Dog 1964. Nice to see you as well. Um, so yeah, I just thought it was uh, a good day just for getting used to the Beaufort scale. And you know what? If you're as sad as me um, and you want to do a bit of reading around the history of the Beaufort scale, go and have a read of that as well. It's fascinating. It's a scale that was developed in the mid to late 1800s and it's still in use now because it is so accurate. Go and have a look, see what you think. Okay, uh, I'm going to leave you with that for now. going to continue uh, my walk and hopefully the sun will be coming out in the next few days. These winds will ease as well. Uh, so things certainly look as if they're going to be getting better weather-wise as higher pressure builds in. Okay, well, have a great weekend and uh, weekend great day. Uh, I was thinking about the weather at the weekend, getting too excited about it. So have a great day and uh, I'll see you soon. Bye for now.